Welcome back everybody to another episode of Final Fantasy X. We're about here to about to go into Xanarkin. I'm pretty excited about this. So without further ado, make sure you guys like, subscribe, uh, share and comment for me. I appreciate it. It helps my channel grow. So without further ado, let's go. What are those? Those are Faith. <sighs> A summoning. Someone is using these Faith. Someone is drawing energy from all of them. This many? Who wields power on this scale? And what could they be calling? Hey, you know something, don't you? Spill the beans! Look not to others for knowledge. This is your journey, too. Yuni might die, you know? No. Aaron's right. Huh? This is our... <sighs> this is my story. Whoa! Welcome home. You... Remember me? We met in the Uh... Yeah? But that, but that wasn't, wasn't the first time we met. I've known about you for a long time. A long, long time. I... I feel like I know you too. Where are we? <laughs> Silly, don't recognize your own home? gotten into you, hey! Wake up! Wake up! Wait, Wait. This, this is a dream. dream. Precisely. A dream? A dream? Are, Are you, you crazy? crazy? I don't I have, have time to be dreaming, dreaming now. You're wrong. It's, it's not, not that you're dreaming. dreaming. You are a dream. Huh, wait, wait a, a sec. sec. Long ago, there was a war. Yeah, with, with Machina, Machina, right? Yes, a war between Xanarkand and Bavel. Bavel's Machina assured their victory from the start. Spira had never seen such power. The summoners of Xanarkand didn't stand a chance. Xanarkand was doomed to oblivion. 
That's why we tried to save it, if only in a memory. What did you do? The remaining summoners and the townspeople that survived the war, they all became Faith, Faith for the Summoning. The Summoning? You mean Sin? No, I mean this place. A Xanarkand that never sleeps. Oh, what? The dreams of the Faith summoned the memories of the city. They summoned all the buildings, all the people who lived there. The people? What? They're all dreams? Me? Too? Yes, you're a dream of the faith. You, your father, your mother, everyone. All dreams. And if the faith stop dreaming... No! no. So, so what, what if I'm a dream? dream? I... I, I like, like being me. here. We've been dreaming so long. We're tired. Would you and your father... Would you let us rest? Both you and your father have been touched by Sin. Sin, the one around whom all Spira... The spiral revolves. What are you saying? You two are more than just dreams now. Wake up! Wake up, please! Just a little more, and maybe... Maybe you... Are the dream that will end our dreaming at last. Are you all right? Oh, phew. Hey, we were so worried about you. You okay? I... I'm okay. What happened? Nothing. I blacked out. I was dreaming. <laughs> you called me. And I woke up. <sighs> Nothing like a good nap. Well, I'm ready. Let's go. So just want to say real quick, this place is like crazy. This has a, this is basically a cloister of trials with Looks like fighting in it. To do, yeah? Basically. If anything should happen in the water, we're relying on you three. If it gets dangerous, pull out quick. Right. Be careful, okay? But it's not really all that difficult of a trials, in my opinion. You just need to hit three buttons, or two buttons.
first try. Easy peasy. <laughs> Yeah, there's two of those we gotta hit, so. We can go this way now, no? Okay, not yet. Oh, that just went back at it. The next one is you have to hit three lights. Well, not really hit, but you have to go to three lights, each corresponding to a different character. And it corresponds with their sphere grid, with the color on their sphere grid. Riku is green. Uh, Titus is blue and Waka is red. Summoner's strength. Who is she? Unaleska. Lady Unaleska. In Zanarkin, she awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down.
I was muted that whole fight. I'm a kind of dumb. I feel dumb again. <laughs> First things first here, we are going to cast haste on everybody. We're gonna cast reflect on him. May or may not need to do this, but I'm gonna do it anyway just for safety reasons. And then dark. So switch uh, Lulu in for real quick, just the uh, guard, then switch for Kamari. Mm. Jump. So next after this, we want to bring in Orin and use Armor Break, Power Break, and Mental Break is optional depending on how strong your party is. I don't think I'm gonna need it. So. Alright, but I also wanna say after this attack, his second usually melee attack, what he does is he uses his uh, Kyurga spells. And if you cast Reflect on him, uh, basically, instead of healing himself, he'll heal one of your party members instead. So that's basically what the purpose of Reflect is. But we're not going to see it because he's dead. <laughs> but that's the fight. there aren't we hmm. we've come a long way <clears throat> what's so funny you remind me of myself hmm? before the closer I came to Xanarkin the more I wondered when we arrive Brasco will call the final Aeon he will fight sin then die I thought my mind was made up long before but when I stood here my resolve wavered hmm Never would have figured. Legendary guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? <laughs> Legendary guardian? I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world too. But I changed nothing. That is my story.
a city dead for a thousand years. A city I had to see with my own eyes. The end of Yuna's journey. The last chapter in my story. My thoughts, they kept floating up and then slipping through my fingers. Slipping away before I could pin them down with words. Yuna, I say no. If we go down there, then you'll... Riku. You're a true friend, and I thank you, but I must go down to Sanarkand. I'm not saying we shouldn't go, but should we think about it some more? There's got to be some kind of way we can save you, Yuna! All my life, I knew this moment would come. Yuni! Thank you, Riku. Thank you for everything. Don't say that, Yuni. It's not over yet. Tell Sid, thank you. No, you can tell him yourself. Because we're gonna see each other again, okay? Kimari, let's go. Sir Oren, Kimari told me, when my father wanted me taken from Bavel to Besaid, it was you who told Kimari, right? I had always wanted to meet you someday. I am truly glad that I had that chance. Having you as a guardian was so great an honor. I don't know how to thank you. Perhaps if I defeat Sin, that will be my thanks to you. That's what I'll do. Yes. I will challenge Sin. I will defeat Sin. If you are all there watching this, then I guess Sin is already gone. And so am I. I suppose. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say, Sir Oren, I thank you. Kimari, <laughs> do you remember the first day we met? I was only seven. My father had defeated Sin. And all Pavel was celebrating. Everyone was saying what a hero my father was. I was so happy. But when night came, it occurred to me. My father had defeated Sin, and now he was dead. Now I was all alone. I couldn't sleep. So I wandered into the town, away from the celebrating crowds. I stood on the bridge in Bavel, where my father and I had parted. Standing there, alone, I could see the fields where he had fought Sin. Then, you appeared, Kamari. You said you were looking for the daughter of Vraska, remember? At first, I was so scared. Until I realized what a gentle, 
person you are. <laughs> you weren't used to talking to children. When I told you that I was Braska's daughter, you said you would take me as far from Pavel as you could. That it was the wish of a man facing death. I think I cried then, because that, that was when I knew my father was dead, and I would never see him again. You just held me without saying a word. I cried after we got to Besaid, too. When you tried to go, after leaving me in the care of the temple, I held on to you crying, don't go, don't go. And you listened, Kimari. You stayed. Kimari, thank you. Thank you so much. And I've always liked your broken horn. Waka. Lulu, I'll never forget my days spent with you, growing up in Besaid. We always played together, us and Chapu. That's why I was always so happy, I think. And when you refused to let me become a summoner, and I did it anyway, I'm sorry. I've always wanted to apologize. You know, when you tried to stop me then, Really, I was happy. I could tell you really cared about me. You were like my big brother and sister. No, I think you really were my big brother and sister. <sighs> what else? <laughs> I love watching you play Blitzball, Waka. <laughs> I even love it when you scold me, Lulu. <laughs> really? I guess that leaves the newest guardian. Star player of the Xanarkand Abes. You are... I am... Well, um... I'm glad... I'm glad that we met. We haven't even known each other that long, but... It's funny. So... So this is what it feels like. It's a much more wonderful feeling than anything I had ever imagined. Wonderful. But it hurts sometimes. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder... I... <laughs> I just want to say thank you for everything. <laughs> maybe... Maybe that's why it hurts. When I... When I think about us never being together again at all... I'm afraid. say that. Uh, I'll do that part over. Um. What you up to?
listen to my story. This may be our last chance. Hey, there was more, right? I mean, like that time... Uh, anyone? I think... Yes? I think that we should stop. Maybe. For now. Let's go. All right, guys, this is where we're going to cut the video right here. I will see you guys in the next episode. But first, make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment, and share. It helps my channel grow. I appreciate it. Without further ado, this is Crazy Steve signing off.